Cab Grip PVC comes in both standard and large canisters. Also available is PVC Untack, specifically formulated for cleaning Cab Grip PVC accessories. Accessories available include hoses, spray guns, replacement brass tips, and splitters to allow for multiple guns on large cylinders. To set up, remove the cap, connect the spray gun to the hose using a 3 quarter inch wrench, and then connect the hose to the cylinder using a 9 16 inch wrench. Prior to spraying, ensure the tip is clean and free of clogs. Then, open the valve on the cylinder to check fittings for any leaks. Be sure to keep the cylinder valve open to maintain pressure in the hose and gun when not in use. Cab grip PVC can be installed in temperatures down to 35 degrees. It's important to note that cylinders must be kept above 70 degrees to spray properly. For applications taking place in ambient temperatures below 70 degrees, utilize power heated blankets and hot boxes when necessary. If the adhesive becomes too cold, it will begin to sputter rather than spray. If this occurs, swap the cold cylinder for a warmer one and return the cold cylinder to a heated area. Prior to application, agitate the cylinder by shaking. This can also help if sputtering occurs prior to cylinder exhaustion. Next, unscrew the safety valve. Then, spray the adhesive in a safe manner until a steady stream without air pockets is presented. On horizontal surface applications, cab grip for PVC can be used for bareback PVC membranes. Following tank preparation, spray the substrate and back of the membrane to ensure 100% coverage by applying with at least 2 to 3 inches of overlap. Apply cab grip for PVC in an even coat, keeping the spray tip approximately 12 inches away from the substrate. Be sure to avoid high thickness buildup and not to apply adhesive to splice areas to be welded. Prior to installation, allow the adhesive to flash off. Flash off times will range between 5 and 7 minutes and the window of application will be roughly 15 to 20 minutes, both depending upon ambient temperature. Once ready, the adhesive will have little to no tackiness. Next, roll the membrane onto the adhesive coated substrate while avoiding wrinkles. Wipe any overspray that may have occurred with PVC membrane cleaner. Following installation, immediately brush down the bonded portion of the sheet with a soft bristle push broom. Following brooming, roll the membrane with a 150 pound segmented roller to achieve maximum contact. Cab grip for PVC can also be installed on vertical surfaces using both bareback PVC and fleeceback membranes. For these applications, follow the same process However, the coverage rate will instead require a 50% overlapping spray pattern. Next, mate the membrane with the wall from the center of the sheet toward the edges, smoothing by hand. Following installation, broom the membrane with a soft bristle broom. <music> Lastly, roll in the membrane with a hand roller. For storage, keep the cylinder valve open to maintain pressure in the hose and keep the spray gun trigger locked when not in use. For long-term storage beyond 30 days, PVC Untack is made specifically for cleaning cab grip PVC from the gun and hose. To flush, turn off the valve and spray until the remaining adhesive is exhausted from the hose. Next, hook the gun and hose up to the Untack canister and spray in a safe manner until all adhesive is cleared. For more information on Cav Grip PVC, contact your local manufacturer's representative.